Hello everyone, Arya here, and I've got an interesting story to tell you guys. Now, I don't know if any of you guys are going to like this story or not, but whatever, so let's get down to it. So, this was about like the middle or so of last month, um, and I, and this was on a Sunday morning, you know, um, early Sunday morning or whatever, I was not feeling good. Like, I was, well, throwing up a lot. I just was not feeling good. I could not keep any food down at all. Excuse me. I was just not feeling good. So there you go. And on top of that, I had this really bad pain in the right side of my body. So, like, um, well, it wasn't, like, all my body. It was kind of, like, well... I just had a really bad pain on my right side. So there you go. Like, it hurt me to get out of bed. Like, getting out of bed in the morning was just physically, it was, like, really, really painful for me. I just couldn't understand what the heck was going on. And I thought it was kind of, like, a stomach thing or whatever. And so eventually on a Wednesday, my dad and I, we went to uh, Providence St. Peter's Hospital and... It turns out that I had a cyst on my right ovary, which was not good. And so my dad and I, we were there from about like 8 o'clock Wednesday night to about 2 or 3 o'clock Thursday morning. Okay. And so then on Friday, we went to see um, an OBGYN and it turns out that... Um, I forget exactly what he said. He said either there was a mass on my right ovary or my my ovary has somewhat got enlarged or whatever. But long story short, I had to have surgery. And um, of course, they also had to take a sample of the mass over to pathology to make sure there was no cancer and stuff like that. So there you go. So I had the surgery on a Monday. I came back home on Thursday. I was originally supposed to go home on Wednesday, but unfortunately... Tuesday night for dinner, I ate something I should not have had, so there you go. Uh, but anyway, so I came back home on Thursday, and, you know, I had to make sure that I was eating right and stuff like that, you know, and blah, blah, blah. And, of course, I had to make sure I wasn't doing anything to the staples that were in me after I had my surgery. So, yes, I actually had, they did not stitch me up after the surgery, they stapled me back up. So, there you go. Uh, but anyway... So a week later on Thursday, I got the staples removed and stuff like that. And as of right now, I'm feeling perfectly fine and stuff like that. And uh, the pathology people or whatever, or someone who works with the OBGYN called me up and let me t t tell, tell me that, hey, guess what? No cancer. So I was like, yes. So there you go. Um, but anyway, so with the surgery I had, um, they had to remove both of my ovaries and my uterus. So there you go. Um, but anyway, but still other than that, um, I'm, I'm feeling perfectly fine. I'm hoping to go back to work, hopefully within the next week or so. Um, so yeah, but anyway, um, so that's my story and stuff like that. And, um, you know, I just wanted to make this video to let you guys know, like, um, to let you guys know what happened to me last month in case any of you guys are wondering, you know, uh, if any of you guys know me from work, you want to know where the hell I've been and stuff like that. So there you go. But yeah, but like I said, I'm hoping to come back to work hopefully in the next week or so. Crossing fingers. Um, so yeah, but anyway, that's all I have to tell you guys. And if anything else interesting happens to me, then I'll let you know about it. So yeah, 